This stunning place is called Porth Dinlan. I believe that's how you say it. And it's on the Clin Peninsula, not too far from Aversoch, on the north west coast of Wales. And then we're in the middle of a heatwave in August, and I believe this is the nearest you'll get to being abroad. It is stunning here. The scenery is absolutely fantastic. So I'm just out having a paddle around here, around the headland as well. Port Dinland there. It's only a very small place, but it's absolutely idyllic. The water's like a lake, it's no wind whatsoever, it's just beautiful. One thing I haven't seen this year is and I haven't seen any seals. Um, I've been kayaking on Anglesey last week off Triada, Triada Bay and I didn't see any there either. Normally I see seals. Loads of them. So I don't know where they are. Really stunning though. Water's like being on a lake. So I've just been around the headland and now heading back. Although I've got my VHF radio, I haven't all my usual kayaking attire. That's because I'm on a holiday. Helen and I were here in the, with the caravan staying just outside Abbasoch. So I'm, it's not a kayaking trip as such, but I've just brought the kayaks to see what I can do. We're coming to pick the pets a week. So this is week two of the heat wave. Like I said, I've been on Anglesey all last week, staying uh, about three miles from Triada Bay. Beautiful there. Uh, Triada Bay on Anglesey. Have a look at it because you could think it was in France. The houses there look like you're in Brittany in France. Whitewash with grey slate roofs. I've often heard about how stunning the scenery is on the Clint Peninsula. It's an area of outstanding natural beauty. But I've never been before and I never expected it to be like this. Of course the weather isn't always like this. I'm sure they get a lot of wind and rain but when you get a week like this who would want to go abroad, really? Especially with all the travel chaos at the moment and all the problems of going abroad. And another thing about it is North Wales, even in high season as it is now, it's not like Devon and Cornwall. You've got the same scenery, stunning scenery, but without all the crowds and the busyness. Yeah, okay, it's a bit busy on the beaches, but some of the more popular beaches, but it's not like Devon and Cornwall. You feel you've got a bit of space. All stations, this is Hollyhead Coast Guard. For the Maritime Safety Information Broadcast, listen VHF Channel 64, Channel 64. This is Hollyhead Coast Guard, out. Hollyhead Coast Guard, Hollyhead Coast Guard, Perception 11 Cayenne. Radio check, please, from Port Inland. Eleven kayak, it says Holly Coast Guard, you've got to read them, over. Thank you for your help, sir. Out. So occasionally I put in a radio check. Channel 16, that's the emergency channel where you, you listen out all the time. It's a requirement if you if you have a radio to leave it on channel 16, the Mayday channel. So you can listen out for anyone in distress, but you can make your first call on channel 16 to the Coast Guard as I did there. And that's just for a radio check. And it's Hollyhead Coast Guard I was talking to, which is over on Anglesey, far side of Anglesey, which 
can now probably see from here if I look carefully. So, uh, Ruby, just did a radio check. check over. And if you look very closely on those rocks in front of me there, you can see four seals basking on the rocks. Grey seals, I believe, or common seals, I'm not sure. I'm not sure we share. <laughs> In fact, I think there's five or six of them. I'm not going any closer because you're not meant to disturb them. But they're basking there in the sun, enjoying the sunbathing. I hope they've got the sun cream on. going to try skirting around there. There's some more seals there. So just when I said there's no seals, I haven't seen any, suddenly they all appear. And just behind me, over my left shoulder there, you can see some more. So here I am back at Port Dinlan. It's been a lovely paddle. Seen the seals, stunning scenery. Saw angles in the distance. It's the end of a lovely trip. <laughs>